in this tutorial we will be covering rib and mirror so to take trials we will just make some objects and one more vertical object we will create on this plane Then extrude. Okay, done. So before that, one more thing. I want this sketch to be symmetry, so that mirror can be will be exactly as per our requirement. So I will just make it symmetry. Then these two vertical points, symmetric around this axis, and done. Then this revolves or this vertical plate also need to be symmetric, so we will also edit that. For this to make symmetric, a vertical center line will be required. Then take symmetric, take two points, and vertical axis. Okay, done. Now we are ready. Suppose I want to create a rib here in the center. So I will take this plane front, then sketch. Then I have to create one line passing through this and this point. So for that I will take some references. Vertical line. Then this horizontal line and this vertical line. Then I will create one line passing through these these two points. Then press done. Then this line is ready. Then with already this line is selected. Then you have to select here profile rib. Profile rib. Now the direction is outside, so outside rib cannot be created. Therefore, it it is not showing the rib. So we have to change this direction to inside. Then we have to change the thickness. What thickness we want? Now our rib is coming 50-50 distance around this sketch. So you can control the direction by clicking on this button. You can make it on the right side, left side, or equal around center line. So in this way you can create rib. Then next we want to mirror this rib to the opposite side. So for that, select the feature. Then here is the mirror tool is there. Then just click on mirror. Then select the plane. So I want to mirror around this plane. So select the plane and say done. So it will be mirror to the opposite end. One more thing. Suppose I want to create a rib connecting two circular parts. Suppose that is my requirement. So how to do that that also we will see suppose i will take this surface then sketch i will create one circle suppose this circle is there then done then extrude then i accept this height then again i will take this surface then sketch then i will take one more other circle Done. Then extrude. So I want a smaller suppose this side. Done. So in between these two circle, I want the rib. So I will take this plane, then sketch, then take take references. So I want a rib connecting to these two points. So take the references of the vertical line, this vertical line and this vertical line. Then say line. Connect these two lines. Then done. Then take profile rib. 
again direction we want it inside now it is not showing even though we are given the inside direction so what happens in this case when it will take the thickness it will not touch the circle therefore it has not created this rip so uh, we will just do some modification to the sketch so we will just try to solve it out so just edit definition suppose we will create one vertical line here and we will see whether it, it can do the rib so we will just say uh, take profile rib so it has created the rib has been created so give the thickness whatever thickness you want and say done so in this way you can create a rib for a circular parts so that's all we'll stop here thanks for joining Thank you.